made it to the cruise. We're all checked in. And now we are just waiting to board the ship. I'm so freaking turned. Everybody have your boarding passes out. Cruise. I'm on the boat. We're walking to our mustard station right now. I am so happy to be here. God got us here safely. Thank you, God. All I can say is thank you, Jesus, for making this possible. I'm gonna try everything. I already know I want some pizza. I can't hardly see. Made it. We are officially on the boat. I haven't got a chance to talk to y'all because they literally play music everywhere and I'm not trying to get copyrighted, but I've been in the pool, I ate. I'm going to show you guys everything tomorrow, but I just kind of wanted to get a feel for my environment while I was out here for the first day, but I will definitely be bringing my camera out way more tomorrow. But the view is really nice. We're on the upper deck. gone. Y'all, we're basically waiting for the boat to leave. I'm going to try to give y'all a boat tour once we get settled all the way. Y'all, we're finally leaving the boat. I started to sail. for a room tour. All right, y'all, so the first thing you see when you walk in is the king-size bed. I mean, it's not really much to show y'all, but I didn't want to give you guys an overview. Here's a bed, two couches. This has a view of the interior of the boat. I don't know what this part of the boat is called, but yeah. So we got an interior room, mirror. Um, I don't know what this is. I guess that goes to another. Whoa. <laughs> Here's a closet, very small. I'm about to get my bags together. There's also a full body length mirror. And then here is the bathroom. Oh, and then here's what the bathroom looks like. Make sure you guys don't trip and fall over this like I just did. It's very small and tight in here. Here's the shower. It's so small. Oh my goodness. Here's the toilet. Ah! I'm on a cruise! I'm on a cruise! Alright, that's basically it for the room tour. I wanted to show y'all before it gets messy. So, now that we are settled in the room, I'm about to check my bag to see if the stash has made it through security. Hold on, let me figure out how to open up my bag. There's a small stash in here. Let me show y'all in a second. So uh, these have a little bit of you know what in it because who's finna buy a drink package? There was one of these and three of these small ones, but the other one popped this morning when I was trying to finish packing. We're gonna try to make this stretch. And if need be, we'll just get some drinks. The lighting in this room sucks, but we are about to go back to one jammer. We went there for lunch but I'm still kind of hungry, so I'm about to go back to go get some more food because why not? I'm on a cruise and I'm trying to eat. I ended up unpacking so it's easier for me to find my uh, clothes I'm gonna wear each day slash night. I'm about to go get some food. Is that another cruise ship over there? Y'all look, it's another cruise ship down there. We're just walking around the boat because the windjammer, which is the buffet, 
doesn't open until 6 p.m. and it's 5.33 p.m. So just exploring the ship a little bit. They have some kids stations. We're on deck 12 right now. Thank you, God. Now the lighting is all crazy. Can y'all see me in here? Like, why is it washed out like that? This room is just too bright. But yesterday it was all messed up with the lighting. Can I put y'all here? It's the next day. Just saying good morning. I just threw on some, a t-shirt. I'm about to throw on my leggings so we can go eat breakfast and watch the sunrise by the water and then once we come back from breakfast and watching the sunrise we'll come in here put on our bandit suits and get ready for the island this is what the rooms look like this is the most quiet the ship is and it sounds so peaceful so we're going to deck 11 we're going to the wind jammer we don't know if the buffet is open, but we're gonna go see. Deck 11. Y'all, we're looking for the one. I think we just came on the wrong side and we gotta walk through again. Y'all, I don't know what's going on with the lighting, like, and I don't wanna play with my settings on my camera because I feel like they're fine. Oh, uh, they closed. They basically put the net on the pool water. You can't go in early hours or after hours. Ooh, that sucks. We're basically walking around the ship. Y'all can't tell, but that's the ocean. It's still dark outside, which is kind of creeping me out, but this is the hot tub. We gotta come out here at night. We're at the Windjammer for breakfast, but of course it doesn't open until seven o'clock a.m. It is currently 5.59 a.m. And my stomach is growling too. I think I fixed my camera. Good morning. Good morning. Some shit, isn't it? <laughs> Y'all, here's the Royal Promenade. I have to come back when it's lit up. I think I got some clips that y'all might have saw earlier. But usually this is lit up as a rainbow. I was washed out because my brightness was messed up, but I think I fixed it for y'all. I'm just walking the royal promenade. This ship is huge. This is basically where all the eating shops are and some other stuff. I guess they want you to book your next cruise here. They might have me with that. The shop, Sugar Beach, Ben and Jerry. Y'all gotta come back here later on and try out Sorrento's. I hear it's really good. This is their pizza. Casino. This is so beautiful, y'all. Like, what? Yeah. I know I haven't been able to talk to y'all as much, but I promise I'm gonna catch y'all up. Just stay with me. Stay with me now. We um, did a quick little tour of the ship. I can't even talk much because there's music playing on every part of the boat. That's the problem. There's music playing on every part of the boat. We're about to go eat breakfast for real this time. This is the pool deck in the morning. They're basically setting up so people can start getting in the water. Alright y'all, I'm about to bust down on breakfast. I gotta talk fast because of copyright. But I got some um, hash browns, eggs, bacon, bread. I got a waffle and a pancake. Watermelon, some diced pineapples, some cheese. He got some sausages, hash browns, eggs. We got everything. We made it to Nassau, Bahamas. I wanted to get some footage of us docking at Nassau, but we're already docked and I think we're about to get off the boat now. You guys can see there's another boat behind me and then Carnival is on the other side of our boat on that side. But 
yeah i'm excited it feels really good outside the weather looks good and it's just a beautiful day i can't wait to get the day started i've never been to the bahamas before i'm outside of the united states of america and i'm having a great time there goes another boat coming in i don't know if y'all can see but yeah the water looks so beautiful Chilling at the beach. Everywhere I go, they're playing music, so I can't even vlog for real, for real. So we are currently sitting on deck 12. Basically, I guess it's not the highest, but we're on deck 12. We're getting ready to leave Nassau. What the fleet? We're getting ready to leave Nassau. We were supposed to leave around 4:30. Alright, we were supposed to leave around 4.30, it's currently 4.50. I guess I can give you guys an update because I didn't really update you guys today like I was supposed to. I don't know what these people are doing, but they're getting on my nerves. They must see somebody they know. Yeah. But yeah, so we spent majority of our day at the beach today i showed you guys some footage and i got some clips in the air with my drone but yeah all we did was eat at nassau um we chilled on the beach i took some pictures and enjoyed the sun so we got some food but it was looking like it was getting ready to storm which is why we came back to the boat around one o'clock p.m but when we got to the boat they were like you can't bring outside food on the cruise ship so we had to eat that before we got back on which was fine because we got to the boat we got back to the boat pretty early but um yeah all i had was some wings and some french fries i forgot to get footage for y'all i was just very hot and the walk from the port to the beach is kind of like a little walk and my feet was hurting but yeah, tomorrow should be very fun. We're going to Perfect Day at Coco K. I'm still gonna get some more footage today, but I did wanna update you guys. I'm still gonna get footage today, but I did wanna update you guys on what's been going on and what I have been doing because I have not been checking in with you guys as much as I should have. But yes. It's so hard recording on vacation, but I'm trying to do my best. Hopefully I put the clips together. <laughs> Hopefully I'll put the clips together to where the movie still comes together or the, the YouTube video still comes together and it looks nice. So these are things we're supposed to be doing, but I don't know if we'll be able to do it, but we'll see. So once the boat sails away, we're going to go down to our room to get ready for dinner. Our dinner is at 8 p.m. It's currently 4.53 p.m. But some things we have scheduled is an outdoor movie. One starts at 6.30 I don't think we're going to the ice skating show because that's at 8 p.m. and that's the time our dinner starts. But there is a movie at 9 o'clock p.m. that we may be able to see. But I don't think I'm getting back in the water today. However, if we do get in the water, it'll be in the hot tub and we're just we're just gonna be chilling. Yes, yeah, thank you. I like being in the water, so if I get in the water again, I'm gonna get in the water again. Y'all, the boat is finally leaving. Here goes Freedom of the Seas. That boat is big. I'm sunburned so bad. Like, my whole body hurts and I put sunscreen on. Bye, Nassau. 
tomorrow is going to be where it's at because we're doing jet skis and I'm also going to go down the water slide that's on the boat. I'm excited about that. My forehead hurts so bad. Can y'all see my sunscreen? Oh gosh. Ah, going down the elevator. Y'all, we need to go here. We went earlier today, but I want to go. We got to go back. Y'all, they came in the room and look what they did with my sunglasses. <laughs> That's so cute. Y'all look at this dollar. I'm dressed and ready for the night. This two piece set is from Pretty Little Thing. Y'all, we're just chilling, sipping on some drinks before our eight o'clock dinner time. It's currently 7.04. We're supposed to be, well, I was gonna put on makeup, but my skin just feels so raw from the sun. Like, I really feel like I'm burnt right now. So I ended up only doing my eyebrows. And now my and now my concealer doesn't even match my face anymore. I got sand in my camera lens. Everything's just a hot mess. But we figured out that Sorrento's is complimentary. And we're gonna go down to the dining room to see what the menu looks like because we're gonna be upset if we go to the dining room and the food isn't good once we finish getting a little drinky drink in our system we'll go from there man this video gonna be copyrighted like a mofo there's music everywhere we go on this ship if you've never been on a cruise please go on one royal caribbean So nice out here. What? I think that might be Royal Caribbean. I'm getting on these tomorrow. I didn't get on these today. And I'm also gonna and I'm also going to try the flow rider. <laughs> All I'm doing is eating on this cruise. That don't make no sense. And we're watching a movie. I don't know what movie this is though. I feel like I look like Larry the Lobster. The main points of my body that are burned and kind of hurt are my shoulders, my nose, my forehead and a little bit of my chest but not as much but yeah today's day three and basically our last full day on the cruise and we are going to royal caribbean's private island perfect day at coco k so i'm just doing my eyebrows i already have my swimsuit on and a cover-up not the cover-up that i originally planned on wearing i have to show you guys that because that cover-up that I ordered from amazon i got it in a large and it was too tight and i was really upset because it was actually a cute cover-up all on vacation i've only been doing my eyebrows even at night for dinner because I don't know, just, it's too much. It's hot, it's humid. I thought I would at least do my makeup for dinner, but I don't even do that. I just do my eyebrows and keep it pushing and put on some mascara with some lip gloss and I'm good to go. I'm starting to get tired, but we are having a lot of fun. I feel like a three day cruise is enough i can't believe there are five day cruises and six day cruises like after today i know i'm gonna be ready to go so the fact that we're leaving tomorrow morning is perfect but that drive home though not looking forward to that i'm using this mascara of course i accidentally purchased dark brown but it still ends up turning out pretty nice in my opinion. And it lasts all day. I need to change my camera battery. <laughs> Two, we 
Oasis to go. This is going to be your third stop off the big bus. All right, stop number three for Oasis to pull. So you guys headed to Chill Island. It's going to be your fourth stop. You go into the short excursion, it's on Chill Island. That's your fourth stop, all right? Or you could just walk right over the bridge by this guy. He's working at the Good morning, y'all. We made it to Perfect Day at Coco K. Here is my beautiful view for the day. I like that there's platforms that make me It's so nice. So we basically have like an hour until our first excursion. Our one and only excursion is just some jet skis. And then we'll be chilling on the beach until like one or two and then I'm gonna get back on the boat so I can get in the pool and do some water slide activities. I got the GoPro out, ready to go. Those rocks hurt. The shells. I'm having the time of my life doing nothing. We're about to explore the island a little bit while we wait for our excursion to start. It's 9, 10, so we have about 50, really 40 minutes, because we have to be there early. But yeah, we're just gonna walk around a little bit. I can't believe how massive the boats are. We're walking to Oasis Lagoon. It's basically this big behind pool with a swim up pool bar. It's really big. You gotta come here for a few hours. That's probably where everybody at. We came over here. We definitely Oh, I love the fish eye view. We made it to the jet skis, but we have to wait till our meeting time. Got my life jacket on, and I also have this with our important things in it. I feel like the downside with cruises is a lot of people in one place at one time. But when you travel alone, you kind of get more exclusivity. Oasis Lagoon.
are walking back to the boat. I have to face this way because the lighting, but we had a great day, a perfect day at Coco Cay. And now I'm about to try to get on the water slide. We're also gonna try to do the flow rider. Look how big these boats are. We came on the independence of the seas to the right and those water slides you guys see at the top. I'm gonna do both of them. I think that's the wind jammer. All those glasses at the top. Thank you, Levin. I can't get over this shit. Let me get B-roll. So right now I'm getting my GoPro situated so we can go down the water slide. It feels so good to be back on the boat because there's just way too many people out there. So I'm gonna get that put together. I need to find my GoPro tripod. I don't know if y'all can see the jet skis, but that's basically where we were riding at earlier today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. getting back to the United States. It's 6.23 a.m. and I'm so sad I don't want to be here. Well, I'm actually ready to go home. I'm not gonna lie, but y'all know what I'm trying to say. I don't wanna leave. Like, what the freak are we doing here? The cruise is officially over. What time is it? It's 7.09, we're waiting for our group to be, ass wait, what? It's 7.09, we're waiting for our time to go down to deck four so we can offboard the ship and hit the road. <laughs> 